Over the skies of Pennsylvania, a local resident caught what looks like a small red object on camera next to the moon in the night sky. Coincidentally, doomsday theorists are saying yet again that Nibiru will cause a doomsday apocalypse on April 23rd. 2019. I'm going to tell you everything you need to know here for you on IO. Welcome back to Inform Overload where we sometimes talk about and debunk conspiracy theories. I'm Charlotte Dobre and one of my favorite conspiracy theories has to be Nibiru, the rogue planet that theorists believe will crash into our planet. It's not that I want a giant planet to crash into us and end humanity, but like you got to admit, it's a fun one. I mean, I also like low key do want humanity to end. Just kidding, I love you guys. On August 24th at 8:10 p.m., the YouTube channel Hidden Underbelly shared a pretty interesting video where next to the moon a bright red object can be seen. The person who made the video also says that the red object is not a lens flare. He points out the other lens flares in the frame. Commenters said the red object could be Mars. Others said that they also saw the red object in the night sky and they believe that it could be Nibiru. Then there were also skeptics who said that the red dot had to be a lens flare. Doomsday theorists believe that at some point in the 21st century Planet X or Nibiru will crash into Earth, causing the end of human life on this planet, also known as the Nibiru Cataclysm and the Day of Rapture, and the Second Coming of Christ, where Christians will rise to heaven and everyone else will die a slow death in hell. Interestingly, Planet X is back in the news again. The Daily Express, an outlet that talks about Nibiru pretty much like any chance they get, I feel like it's like every month. They published yet another story recently where they say the Nibiru cataclysm will occur on April 23rd next year. They said, and I quote, On April 23rd, the Sun and Moon will be in Virgo, as will Jupiter, which represents the Messiah. Hey, I'm a Virgo. Does that mean I'm a Messiah? Charlotte the Potato Messiah. I am no longer the Potato Queen, I am Potato Messiah. Another planetary alignment that is supposed to occur on April 23rd represents the lion and the tribe of Judah, and the planet responsible for this alignment is Nibiru. Multiple huge news outlets are talking about this supposed doomsday apocalypse that is supposed to happen on April 23rd of next year. Space.com, Forbes, National Geographic, The Washington Post, they all published stories recently about the doomsday theory. Only these news outlets debunk the claims. My favorite article is the one from The Washington Post titled Just Kill Us Already Planet X. That one that one hit home. If Planet X killed us, I wouldn't have to make another video on it, that's for sure. I can't tell which is worse. Make video on Planet X, die fiery death by Planet X. NASA has debunked any existence of a giant rogue planet multiple times. They suggest instead that there could be a large object, dubbed Planet 9, at the edge of our solar system, beyond Neptune, that is throwing celestial bodies off their orbit. But NASA said a few years ago, no giant rogue planet has been found in the outer solar system to play the role of Nibiru. Planet 9 is only a theory right now. So for now, we're gonna go with NASA's argument. And the object that was seen in the night sky over Pennsylvania? Well, I honestly couldn't tell you what it was, but my my best guess is that it was a lens flare. If you look closely, the red object does sort of look like the moon. The highlights and shading on it is similar to the moon's. Plus, like I feel like we would really feel the gravity of an object that close to Earth. I mean, I'm not a scientist, but I feel like we would notice. <laughs> All right, that is all I have for you on that story. Let me know. Do you think Nibiru will crash into us? Do you want it to crash into us? While you ponder that, I'm going to do some comment replies. Woohoo! Do the comment dance. Yes, Ali said, "Hey Charlotte, it's my 14th birthday tomorrow, and yet one of the most exciting things is still seeing what wacky yet entertaining video you put out tomorrow. Keep up the amazing work. Love you. Mm, you're such a sweetie. Happy birthday, and I hope it's the best friggin' birthday you've ever had. Eat a whole cake. Okay, l save me one slice. Just one slice." I hope it's shaped like a potato. Tomboy Gamer said, I was watching a live stream of the Tomato Queen. Who is the Tomato Queen? I must meet her and kill her. The Mysterious Squishy said, Did you just do your nails? If so, they look great. I did. I feel like they're a bit over the top, but then again, I'm also over the top, so it works. Caius Jones said, Wear a green skin suit for one video so you are just a floating face, please. I don't need a green skin suit to be a floating face. Welcome to the end screen, this means the video is over. Don't worry, if you want to watch more videos like this one, there's a playlist over there. By the way, if you enjoyed your time here, make sure you smash the thumbs up, subscribe, and notification bell, and I will see you in a future IO video.